Good morning. morning. Good morning, guys. This morning we're going on a little road trip. So this morning I spent some time preparing some food. I've got my breakfast ready to go right here. I'll show you that in a second. But today we are, where are we going? Tell them where we're going. <coughs> wow, that is creepy. I know. Okay, it's there's real. gardeners outside <laughs> our place right now, and because the sun is so strong here, they have completely like white faces, like full of like zinc oxide, I, I guess, to protect themselves. That is. Yeah. But there's a guy too. Um, it's really creepy. <laughs> today we are going to the Dane Tree Rainforest. It's one of the oldest rainforests in the world, and it's going to be absolutely beautiful. And some, you've been there before, right? I've been there before in 2011. And that's one of the first Instagram photos that I saw of you, was you in the rainforest. I was like, ooh, <laughs> he's good looking. Anyways, um, how long of a drive is it? Probably like an hour or so? More than an hour. It takes oh. an hour to get to Port Douglas, so let's let's see. This is a very awkward angle. Head east on Great Slope Street towards Bear Street. I think two hours, 17 minutes. That's a long drive. I'm glad I packed food this morning. So let me explain to you my beautiful breakfast. We've got what what do you know I'm I'm having oats for breakfast last night I just put one cup of steel cut oats because I made enough for the both of us in case he wanted to have some but I don't know if you're really that hungry for breakfast I might end up eating all of this um, I put one cup of steel cut oats and then one and three quarter cup milk and then I just put it in the fridge to let it soak overnight made overnight oats with steel cut oats and then I just topped it off this morning with some frozen blueberries chopped banana and then I also put some coconut yogurt if you can see that oh yes so this is my breakfast while we have a beautiful scenic two-hour drive ahead of us to the rainforest and yeah very excited to eat this haven't had overnight oats in a while Let's give you a taste test before we start driving and I can't film. It's good. What can I say? Breakfast on the go. The ferry. I've never been on a ferry in a car before. And it's $28 to just go right over there. Just just across the waters. But I'd rather pay $28 than get eaten by a crocodile in the water, so you know. <laughs> it's fine. You don't swim across, you don't want to swim across. No, I would die. I get eaten. <laughs> the crocs are just here we go. We're getting on the ferry. Turn the car off. Probably should have rolled the windows down before. Yeah, we're here. It's all I'm, good. I feel like a hot dog. A hot dog. I feel, I feel like, like a dog. A hot dog. <laughs> I feel like a dog in a hot car right now. I'm dying. Sorry there, Sheila. <laughs> we're almost there. We're almost across the river. We've made it. We are one hour into our drive and we have how many more minutes to go? Like 45 more minutes? No. Yeah. No. Yeah, click it. Absolutely no. Oh, 25 more minutes. It said 45 like 10 minutes ago. Yeah, before we cross the river, mate. Ah, it takes into account the ferry. The ferry, mate. Ah. 25 more minutes and then we'll be at the rainforest. And we're officially in the jungle. In the jungle. <laughs> oh my gosh. We made it. We actually ended up driving way too far and we missed it and then we had to drive back, but we have made it into the beautiful rainforest and now, how long do you say this walk is? Like an hour? An hour, if you listen to all the audio. Oh, you can walk they give it. you like little audio things so you can listen to like learn about it, but I don't know. We're just gonna walk around and enjoy the beautiful jungle that this rainforest is. So many different kinds of berries and stuff. And berries and so cool. Yeah. 
the air is like so dense and like full. Oxygen I don't know how to rich. explain it. <laughs> yeah. Fruit eaters of the rainforest. They should have you up on there. Hey, it's me. <laughs> I want to see some stuff. It's going to be hard to spot them out, baby. I should have brought my binoculars. <laughs> Going up this canopy, or this tower. We got Maddie's favorite. Snakes. <laughs> I don't like snakes. I really don't. And I don't like that they're... Like I mean, look guy. at his face. His face is kind of cute. He's I don't really cute. like how they're kept in these little cages, though. They should be out in the wild. They should be out in the jungle. We didn't know that they had a reptile display before we came here. His name is Spotty Spot Spot Spots. <laughs> <laughs> He's really cute. Demon Duck of Doom. <laughs> yeah, if I saw that, I'd be like, I'm doomed. <laughs> oh, moon. oh my gosh, it moves. Dude, can you imagine coming across that, like, in real life? No. That thing will eat you whole. Whoa, raptor. It's like me. <laughs> I'm a Quantasaurus. Imagine seeing that in real life. I would die. I'd be like, hey, you wanna be my friend? <laughs> be like, oh, you're so cute. It's crazy to think these things ever existed. Like... Now all we have left are chickens. Chickens and, and they're cute. Pigs. No, pigs are not derived from. I know, I'm kidding. <laughs> well, that was an enjoyable little canopy walk. It was. We're gonna try and see if we can find another one, though, right? Yeah. We made it to another boardwalk. We found a free boardwalk. This is the one that Kyle went on. What year is it? 2011. Yeah. Ah. It's hot, it's humid, my hair is growing by the second. <laughs> We're in the rainforest, everybody. So we're on our way out from the rainforest and we came to this beautiful lookout. Oh my gosh. Gorgeous, eh? So beautiful! Like that? Oh my goodness. Well, you can't really see it, but let's try. We'll, we'll screenshot it and we'll throw it up. You guys can look at it. That's little baby Kyle. And it's literally, literally taken right there. Now you've got a beard too. <laughs> Last stop of the day is Port Douglas. We've walked up to like this little, little outlook. It's really nice. And we're gonna head down to the beach and eat some lunch, cause we are hungry. It's called Four Mile Beach. Cause it's four mile long? Yeah. Wow, I guess it does go all the way around here. They have a really big swimming section here. Yeah, they do. It's really much big. bigger than all the beaches closer to us. Let's go! All of this is all little balls of sand made from crabs digging. I don't know where all the crabs are. They're everywhere here. Uh. Oh, whoa, there's so many! Look at all Probably can't see them on camera, but... It's crazy! <laughs> this whole thing is just covered. There's a crab. Getting closer. That's the Discovery Channel for ya. 
Don't! Don't See be you. mean! Looks good, Bobby. I'm hungry. Did you bring salt? You didn't bring any salt? I didn't bring salt. Ah, extra lime drizzle for me. I got extra, I brought lime, so. I made us some lunch this morning before we left. this little salad, avocado. I brought greens for myself because Kyle doesn't like greens, so only greens for myself. Extra dressing, avocado, lime juice, whoops. You gave yourself more avocado. What is that? I got the bigger half of avocado. Fine, here, you want some of this? There. In that. This? Yeah. There you go. It's a perfect on-the-go meal. Literally took me like 20 minutes to make everything this morning. So this is a really good, like anything burrito bowl-like is perfect to take with you on like a busy day or a work day even. You gonna give us a little taste test? Yeah. Oh man, so excited. I'm so hungry. this food, this view. I'm a happy, happy gal, that's for sure. So, I realize I look like a total crazy person right now, but we just got home. We're pretty tired. We had a pretty late lunch, but we're just gonna have an early dinner and go right to bed and I'm pretty much making what we have every single night. It's super easy and it's just so like wholesome and delicious. And I said this last night that I could eat this every single day for the rest of my life and be happy. So I've made, I'm making, I haven't made them. <laughs> I'm making sweet potatoes and I am roasting them in a little bit of cinnamon. And it's just the best way to eat sweet potatoes. Like I, don't like I usually don't like orange sweet potatoes like I've said this before on the vlog like I don't really like orange sweet potatoes but I've learned to love them and I love them like I can't get enough of them eating them like this when they're so, air fried yeah it's the oven too <laughs> it has like a air it has like a fan function so it like really like crisp the outside and then the inside is just so like gooey and like Creamy. really good and I just think the sweet potatoes here are good yeah I don't know and then I am marinating some tofu right now, and I've marinated it in this Coco Mino teriyaki sauce that we picked up at the grocery store. I don't know, it's good. It tastes a little bit like sweet, kind of like teriyaki sauce. And then I've also put a little bit of paprika, so I'm just marinating that. And then I'll put this on this pan after the sweet potatoes are halfway done cooking. And then we're gonna make some more quinoa Having a rice cooker is like the best thing ever because all you have to do is like click cook. You don't have to think about it. Um, yeah, we're making some more quinoa. Usually I would have like another grain since we already had a bunch of quinoa today, but because we're traveling, we like to just buy one thing at a time, use it up before we move on. And then I'll just have like some greens and avocado and stuff like that. But gotta cook these babies up first. My prized protégés in the oven a lot of sweet potatoes tonight actually. Yeah. 
And this is what I'm having for dinner. This is my dinner. The past how many days since we filmed the taste test, he's like, no more junk food. I'm not <laughs> getting myself any junk food. Every single day, he's either bought cookies or ice cream. Or like... What else? Chips? No, I haven't had any No, chips. it's cookies. Cookies or ice cream? They have a lot of vegan cookies here in Australia. I've gained weight. Kyle, every day, he's like, I'm fat, I'm gaining weight, <laughs> I need to get in shape. But then we go into the store, oh, can I get some cookies? I haven't been, <laughs> yeah. I've been stuffing myself. Anyways. That's okay. It's good to enjoy. Indulge? Indulge. It's all good. Yeah, it's all good. Alright, you and me. Let's go to bed. Got a bed in my so so good almond hey, ice cream. Hey, you need to have dinner first. We're just gonna jump in bed together. No, you're not. No? Okay. Goodbye. Oh, I actually have some dumplings. Maybe I'll make some dumplings. Ooh. Yes, I will. I'm making dumplings. <laughs> Plot twist. She's making dumplings. These are left over from the taste test video. And I'm gonna make those to go with my dinner bowl. Dinner! Dinner! All right guys, and this is the final product. This is what all my bowls every single night pretty much look like, minus the dumplings. <laughs> um, but we've got the sweet potato, the baked tofu, we've got some beetroot sauerkraut, a bunch of greens under there, some chopped red cabbage, a little bit of quinoa, uh, cucumber. This is that cheese that we had in the taste test. Really, really good chili cheese. And then also the dumplings. And this is like a huge bowl. I've been eating out of this massive salad bowl. You can see, like, that's my hand. It's a pretty big bowl. <laughs> and then to top it off, you gotta add some tahini in there, especially on the sweet potatoes, you know, the quinoa. Ba-bam. That's dinner, my friends. Super quick, easy, healthy, you just throw it together. Amazing. All right, guys, so that pretty much wraps up today's video. I'm going to eat this, enjoy, and then go to bed because I am exhausted. I don't know what it is. I think it's like I get really tired during like my ovulation time and I don't know. I don't know. But the heat. Yeah, and also just like so much like stimulation from being in like so many new places all the time, like going and exploring and stuff. I don't know. Anyways, um yeah. We had a really awesome day today though. Like it was so much fun. I don't really know how much of it came across, but I feel like we saw so much today and like it was just so beautiful and we're definitely gonna go back. It, it is like a far drive, but like it was incredible. We need to go back. So we're going to go back another time before we are out of here. And yeah, I feel like I'm rambling, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Tofu with this cheese is like on another cheese. level. I love it. Cheese sucks. It does not. So you bad. said you liked it in the taste test. Yeah, I hate it now. <laughs> More for me. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!